Stuck with an unresponsive iPhone screen and need to turn it off? Today, I'll guide you through the exact steps to shut down your iPhone without using the touch screen. Whether your screen is frozen or just not working, these methods will get your device off safely. There are a few different ways to turn off an iPhone depending on the model you have. I'll walk you through each method so you can find the one that works for your specific iPhone. Let's start with the most recent models. If you're using an iPhone 8 or newer, here's how you can turn it off without the touch screen. First, quickly press and release the volume up button. Then, quickly press and release the volume down button. Right after that, press and hold the side button. Keep holding the side button down until the screen turns off completely. This might take a few seconds, so be patient and ensure you hold the button until the screen goes completely black. For those with an iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus, the method is slightly different. Instead of using the volume up button, you'll need to press and hold the volume down button along with the side button at the same time. Hold both buttons down until the Apple logo appears, and then the screen turns off. It's crucial to wait until the screen goes completely dark to ensure the phone is fully off. And if you have an iPhone 6S or an older model, you'll use the home button along with the side or top button. Press and hold both the home button and the side button simultaneously. Keep them pressed until your screen shuts off. This will typically take about 10 to 15 seconds, but it's important to keep holding until the screen is completely black. A quick tip for troubleshooting, sometimes changing the text to bold in your settings can refresh your screen. To try this, go to settings, then display and brightness, and toggle the text to bold. This may force the screen to restart, which isn't a shutdown, but it could help in some situations. That's it for the video. I hope these steps helped you solve the issue with your unresponsive iPhone screen. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and consider subscribing for more useful tech tips. Also, if you have any questions or additional tips that worked for you, drop a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.